Hey everybody, good morning. How are you doing here? Mark Bosley. What a great, great, great Friday it's going to be. I'm looking forward to talking with folks today and just, uh, you know, helping people solve a few problems and putting my business, you know, in front of them and maybe, maybe something that I have will be a good fit for them. I'm very optimistic about the people I'll be speaking to today and also be following up with a lot of the people I spoke to yesterday which was actually a very productive day. Thursdays are very big for me. First of all, let me say this video is about uh, Craigslist. Uh, I want to make this today about some tricks and tips that might help you with your Craigslist posting ads to prevent you or to slow down or to stop you from getting some flagging or ghosting. I know that's a real problem with a lot of people and, and it used to be for me until I learned this industry right here. And from time to time, they still get me, but they got to be pretty sharp to get me now, okay? Um, and yeah, I did talk to a lot of people yesterday, so I look forward to following up with those guys today and seeing if, uh, you know, what I have will be awesome for them. Okay, anyways, guys, when you post your ad on Craigslist, this is what it's look, uh, look like when it's live, okay? We're not going to go into a big, long, drawn-out video about how to post an ad. We're going to just do some tricks and tips about how to how to help you keep your ad live and not get that pink banner up here, okay? This is what your ad will look like when it's live. You'll have the green banner up here and then you'll have these features buttons right here, okay? And they tell you where your ad can be seen. This is in uh, in my state in Tuscaloosa. I just, I post all over my state. I love my state. I have a great connection. I, I do very well within the borders of my own state. I do post outside my state all the time when I do uh, paid Craigslist advertising. I do very well with that. A paid Craigslist advertising will make you a living. Trust me. Anyways, let's jump right into the video, guys. So first of all, let's go to the title. Okay, when I posted this yesterday, you can see it was 23 hours ago, almost a day. She's still flying, no problems at all. See my title right here, Immediate Positions Available. First of all, I have a call to action card right here. The immediate means it's a sense of urgency with whoever's looking at this ad, okay? It's immediate and there are positions available. Pretty basic stuff, but to the mind, the mind taps in on certain words, okay? And also, this is, looks like a little basic title. Yeah, I agree with that, but here's something I did differently. I put what I call these little mountaintop, little symbols right here on either side of the title itself. You can find these symbols right here on the key uh, buttons on your keyboard, okay? Like this is under the number six key, this is what I call a mountaintop, okay? So I put these on either side right here so this title would stand out. It wouldn't look like everybody else's, okay? And we'll go to that here shortly and I'll show you, okay? Moving forward, guys, I want to continue to use these little mountaintop thingies. I put these first. I put them in a series right here. I put five of them side by side, four, three, two, one. And then I posted my ad. Okay, just a short ad, a brief ad, just to create curiosity. You don't want to spend a lot of time typing out some big, long, drawn-out ad. You just want to pique their curiosity you know, and, and see if they'll click on your ad, see if it's something that might be a good fit for them. You want to let your video presentation or your phone conversation do the selling and telling for you. All this video, all this ad does is create curiosity. No said that twice, I'm going to say it again. All I want you to do is create curiosity. And you do that with certain keywords. You're like, now free training must be self-motivated those words right there are words that work on people's minds okay really it does um, expect to make 600 weekly and that's if you're self-motivated that's if you you uh, 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 um, have a drive to succeed guys okay it's not a lottery ticket it's not a get rich quick you must have a drive to succeed you must be self-motivated you must be willing to do the work it's not hard work but it is work okay and you get to do it from your home okay so I put in there expect 600 weekly you can do twice that you can do a lot more than that if your if your <clears throat> drive is like mine if you're like super motivated it's like five o'clock in the morning and I'm making this video right here okay guys I'm gonna make two or three more videos because my drive is like hundred and ten percent okay 
Uh, the only applicants we're accepting at this time are for full-time positions. So you want to try and limit the field of people that's going to contact you and you have already kind of asked them or planted the seeds of what questions they're going to ask you. Is this full-time? Is it from home? You put, is this a 1099 position? So they know uh, they're responsible for their taxes. I mean, it is a legitimate business so you're going to be responsible for your taxes okay but this I'm getting too much into the ad right now this is really about tips and tricks for the to get your ad to stay live okay but these are a few keywords a few search engine words that you might want to consider you might want to look at when you're creating your own ads okay please don't copy and paste this exact same ad because all they'll do is a flag it. you could copy and paste it and mix it up from one line to the next so that will be fine repunctuate it put different symbols right here and make it a little bit different of course you'll have your different phone number in there okay so moving forward okay we've we put the symbols beside the title we put a few right here in the series we posted our ad and then we come down here and we put them again we just start over and went backwards one two three four five with symbols again okay and it's really just to throw off craigslist trackers or craigslist software or those guys who are seeking to flag mlm and network marketers because they're not real friendly with uh, some craigslist so we have to think and be creative about ways to get our ads to fly okay um a network marketer would spot this and that's one thing you got to keep in mind is your competition could flag you okay that's that's the bad part about it is your competition could flag you okay but guys that is my video let me show you how to <clears throat> very quickly let me bring this down a little bit right here let me show you how to um, to um, add an image to this I have no image right there and it's really a good idea for you to post an image you know with your uh, with your business right because it, it just give people another reason to want to click your ad okay and that's key in this business is getting people to notice you know what it is you're doing I'm just trying to make some adjustments here because I'm getting ready to go to my images okay so let me go ahead and click uh, update images okay add images and I'm gonna put in here I'm gonna put uh, a, I already have one anyone can do this let me type this okay now there's an image right there I'm gonna post right now okay and then I'm gonna put done with images okay so this is what my ad will look like when it goes when I publish it okay it's an unpublished draft so give it just a moment you can see where it's at it's in the gig section the computer gigs okay what I posted yesterday. Come on down. Of course, you can see my title. And now you can see that there's an image in my ad right there. Okay. So let's go ahead and come on down to the bottom of the page. I always click the publish button at the bottom of the page. I don't know why. I just do. And I never get flagged. It's just a thing with me. Okay. So I'll go ahead and publish that. Okay. So now let's go to my ad on Craigslist. Let's go to Craigslist. Okay, I'm going to show you my ad live. This is in my state of Alabama. This is in my state at Huntsville. Let's come down here to, uh, where was it, Tuscaloosa? Is that where it was at? So we got to do that so we can get down here farther. Okay, Montgomery. What, what am I not seeing? Tuscaloosa. <clears throat> There we go, Tuscaloosa right there. Sorry about the delay, guys. And then it's in Tuscaloosa, Alabama. So let's come down to the gigs. We click computer right there. And you'll see right here. See there? Boom, there's my ad right there. Now it's got a picture on it. You see my ad title does not look like everybody else's, does it? It's got these little thingies out to the side, which makes it stand out compared to the rest of the, of the field, okay? We'll go ahead and click on my ad right there. And you'll see, there we go. Boom. Okay. Got a little crazy there at the end. Sorry about that, guys, but you get the gist of it. Okay. Anyways, guys, that's my video for this morning. Uh, in the description box below, I will put my business where you can find, once you join me, my Facebook group, my training group. All that's free. All this training is free. And tomorrow, I will show you how to... Um, 
I really I want to talk to you more about um, how to get people to respond to you. You know, about your phone number being in here, this little section right here. How to change that up to make people want to call you, okay? I'm going to teach you that by giving away a free gift, a free bonus, okay? But anyways, look in the description box below and you'll see my Facebook link so we can connect. You'll also see the link to my online business. And I uh, look forward to you guys connecting with me. We'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye.